There have been dreams for a very long time of robust commercial activities in space with growing populations and so forth. Now we have access to systems that cost less to launch and land, and we now understand how to build destination systems that last for a long time. It's the commercial world in which advanced capabilities get normalized and become a part of everyday life. Orbital Reef is a full-fledged commercial space station. Think of it as a village. Think of it as many different organizations and people in their own parts of Orbital Reef doing their own activities. Where all types of companies can come together and do research and or production and also provide opportunities for tourists to come and just experience what space is like. It's an ecosystem that will allow ideas to grow, to germinate, whole new fields and areas of economic arena, new science that we can't even imagine now. Orbital Reef starts with two strategic partners, Blue Origin and Sierra Space. These two together have the fundamental elements that give us both transportation of cargo and crew and the destination system essentials. In addition, we have a set of expert teammates, which includes Boeing, who will be developing our research module. Uh, we'll be providing crew and cargo transportation with the Starliner. And when the orbital reef is operational, we'll provide all of the operations and maintenance uh, necessary to sustain the orbital reef. Genesis, who are developing the single-person spacecraft for suitless extravehicular activity, ASU is going to bring together this international group of 14 universities to work with Orbital Reef on the ethics and guidelines of research, on how we can bring to bear all of our expertise. And Redwire, who provide in space manufacturing. Leveraging the microgravity environment to push new science, new discoveries, and new commercial applications. We're working very hard to make sure that Orbital Reef is not just for the entities that have had access to space so far. It's intended to be humanity's footprint in Earth orbit, and that means all the nations and companies and peoples of the world. I think that Orbital Reef offers us an opportunity at this point in history to really approach the next frontier as humans and to expand beyond the surface of the planet. Maybe there's a company that wants to manufacture materials in space. Maybe there's a school that wants to send an experiment up. Maybe there's a nation that's ready to send someone into low Earth orbit to inspire their entire nation. It's limitless, the implications of microgravity research, development, and manufacturing. Every aspect of our life, of industry, of science, will be impacted by the discoveries that we make on Orbital Reef. This unique environment that's only a couple of hundred miles away from us is both transformative and accessible. It's incredibly exciting.